Hey friends, welcome back to Bitfumes again. I'm your host Sarthak and you can also call me Angur. And thank you for the subscribing. Because of you, I have reached the 100 subscriber mark and my next target is to get the 500 subscribers on my channel and please support me to get that. Okay, if you like my videos, please subscribe and share these videos. Now, in this episode, we have we are going to study the directory part of this file storage system. And what is that? That means we will create a directory, we will delete a directory, uh, we will see how the how many files in a directory is. So we will play the with the directories. We have successfully created a system where we have uploaded a file in our storage app and public folder. Okay, so let's dive into that thing. So for that, I, the first thing I want to show you is that we have to create a show function and in that show function, I will firstly just return, return what? Return show word, okay, for just checking the route. So I will just go and create a route called show function is also show and method is get now go to our browser here i will say show and yeah that means our route is working fine so what i want to do in this show function is that i will just return return what storage and obviously i will say files and files in which folder in public folder so what this statement will do this statement will give me an array of the file name situated inside this public folder okay and we know that this public folder is inside the storage app and the public folder not inside this public folder okay we will talk about this public folder why is it here and how we will connect this with our this public folder so let's just go and click refresh and you can see there is obviously four files inside that public folder okay and you can see there you have the public folder and in that public folder you have three files and obviously three files are same and this git ignore obviously i don't know what is that file okay so we have seen that how much easy is to show any file inside a folder okay the next thing is i will just add one thing i will say all files so let's just quickly refresh this so you does not get any difference so what is the difference between simple files that means this and this so for that i will just upload a new file but inside a new folder so let's just upload a file click upload and you can see now this file is stored inside public and inside new folder okay you can see this public folder has a subfolder of new and in that subfolder our file is uploaded now go to the show and you can see now it is five files now again i don't get the difference between all files and simple files for that i will show you one thing I will just say here files and now when I click refresh you can see only four files are there that means if you write simple files then it will give me the files inside this public folder but when I want to get all file inside the public folder and inside its subfolder then I will say all files so all files will get the information of all the files inside a folder and inside its subfolder also okay so we have seen the two things the next thing is i want to create a directory so i will say make directory and you can see how much descriptive is that that will so easy okay now i will say inside public folder let's create a folder called Mm, let's say make <laughs> I don't get any word <laughs> okay so when I go here and click refresh you will see an error 
and why this error because we have returned this this will give me a boolean function and when i want to return that boolean it will show me an error but it doesn't mean that we have something wrong we have done everything correct and for that you can see inside a public folder there is a subfolder called make that means our function is working fine but it will return true or false and that will not be shown so that's why it is giving me, me error okay now what if you want to delete any directory so i think you have got the idea you just have to say delete public and make but in this time i don't want to get any error for that i will just say if then what can you do then just return return deleted okay now go back click refresh and yep we don't get any error because we have wrapped it into a if else so you can check that the make folder is deleted by going to public folder and you cannot see any make folder so you can see how much easy is to play with the directories inside the public folder okay so we will meet in the next episode where we will finally show the files inside our browser so if you have any doubt in this episode or even in any of my videos feel free to comment me you can follow me on twitter facebook and instagram share this video with your developer friends so that i will get on my goal of 500 subscribers so till then bye bye